Welcome to the funkiest ski jumping competition in the world. That's horizontal snow. That's going to be really unpleasant. That's me going off to the right a bit there. That's some lights that I'm hoping they're not going to point in my eyes. We could do with some snow on that course, let's be honest. And let's not have fireworks going on while I'm trying to jump, please. No distractions. No distractions. I think we all know that ultimately I am a bit of a legend at the ski jumping. Better than you. Better than that. That's a big moon. Better than any of these athletes at all, ever. However bad I am at Winter Games, the one thing that I'm always able to do, yeah, you need some snow there, you need some snow, is ski jump. And I'm brilliant at it. And that's all you need to know. Oh, okay, that was maybe more my quality of jump. They're not very good, these people, are they? Look, they're flopping all over the place like a big floppy thing. I'm gonna beat all of you. Including you in your pastel pink costume. And Norway, who never failed to cause me problems. Let's do it. Lade Vorgang. That's German for Jenny is going to be epic. But first she needs to learn. Let's learn how to ski jump, which usually helps. I say usually. I can't guarantee anything. Here we have the great ski jumping tower of Germany. Welcome to the training. This is where you learn the basics about the controls in RTL Ski Jumping 2007 and how to take off correctly in order to make good distances. The game will pause during the explanations. Afterwards, it's up to you. If you wish to skip an explanation, press the left mouse button. I will. That's Mr. Sarcastic Commentator, isn't it? If you haven't heard from Mr. Sarcastic Commentator before, click the video in the top right-hand corner. Every jump starts at the start bar. Get ready in front of the screen. If you want to start, press the left mouse button. I want to start. I'm going to have to be George Bosch for this, whose wax settings are 80%. Well, good for you, George. Nice drone cameras. Did they have those in 2007? I don't think they did. That's a big mountain. OK, whoever it is who's got the air horn, we get it. You now have 10 seconds to familiarise yourself with the wind. Have a look at the windsock to the left. If it's fluttering, that means there is a crosswind you need to take into consideration during the flight. If you want to start immediately, press the left mouse button. Hmm, the wind is against me, it would seem. I've told you, air horn man. A smooth approach run improves your speed, so pay attention to your balance. The indicator at the bottom on the right will help you. If the ball is in the centre, you are in perfect alignment. If it moves to one side, you can use the mouse to steer carefully in the opposite direction to regain your balance. I like this mouse business. At the moment, no keys have come into this at attention. all. Attention! We're off! We are! Let's go! There we go, I can just do it with the old... The old mouse, that's that good. That was excellent. Now <sighs> let's turn to the takeoff. At first, you need to build up enough power. Look at the bar at the bottom on the right. Press and hold the left mouse button as it approaches the mark in the middle. Release the button just before the end. You will take off automatically. How did the previous version of this not do and it with a mouse? Go. Let's go, let's go! That's not quite how to do it. Let's not. You pressed the button too late and released it too late. Try again. Drat, as I was saying, why do we not have things with go. keyboards? You Whoop. took off too early. Oh. Only release the mouse button when the bar is completely to the right. Okay. Ready, steady, go! I can do this, I can, I can do this now! That's not quite how to do it. <gasps> you pressed really? the button too late. Let's go. Goodness sake. Now. That's not quite how to do it. Attention. Right, now you're taking the piss, aren't you? Now. That's not quite how to do it. <laughs> you said and all the way off. over. Now. You took off too early. Only release the mouse button when the bar is completely to the right. It was completely to the right. You said that was too late. And now you're saying it's too early. What? Go. Now. The takeoff was correct, but there was not enough power. Press the left mouse button when the bar hits the mark in the middle. Right. Ready. No. Steady. No. Go. Now. 
You took off too early. <laughs> Only release the mouse button when the bar is completely to the right. Oh, God. Let's okay. go. Now. That's not quite how to... Right, I'm getting mad now. Now. That's not quite how to... I'm getting really mad now. Now. The takeoff was correct, <gasps> but there was not enough power. Press the left... Go. Now. The takeoff <laughs> was correct, but there was not enough power. <laughs> Ready? Now, now. Let's go. Go. Now, now. The tape <laughs> was correct, but there was not enough power. Press the left mouse button when the bar hits the mark in the middle. Oh, my God. Seriously? Attention. We're off. Now. The takeoff was correct, but there was not enough power. Press, Press the, the left, left mouse, mouse button, button when, when the, the bar hits the mark. Right. And... Middle. You took off too early. <laughs> Only release the mouse button when the bar is completely to the right. Which bar? Which, which, which bar are we talking about? I'm getting really annoyed now. Go. I don't want to go anymore. Ready? No, I don't, I don't want to. Now? Let's go. No. Over there? The no. Attention. Over there. There? You took off. And on. There. That's not quite how to do it. <laughs> you press the... Ready? Oh, hello. You took off too early. Let's it's go. It's gone green. Now. You took oh, off too early. Okay, right, hang on. There. There. Very good. Yes! You have successfully taken off. Thank God for that. Now, in order to fly a good distance, you need to get into the V position and counteract any crosswind during the flight. To do this, pull the mouse back. Flying V. Got it. And on we go. Flying V, flying V, flying now V. Now get your skis into the V position. To do this, pull the mouse back. Flying V, flying V, flying V. I'm pulling it back. Flying V. Woo the wind's pushing you to the right. Steer carefully to the left with the mouse to make the jumper horizontal again. I don't like this being with the mouse anymore. You have to maintain balance during the flight. I know. Go. Now get your skis into the... Yeah, I get it, I get it, I get it. Yep, 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 yep. The flight was even, but you didn't get into the V position. I think I did. That's a V, this, is it not? Pull back the mouse immediately after the start. Is that not a V? That looks like a V Ready? to me, sir. That's a The wind's v. pushing you to the right. I'm in the V. That's a V. You have to maintain balance. Let's I go. I know. Oh, you're going to make me do it again? Right. Now get your skis into yeah, the... Yeah, I intend to. Thank you. The flight was <sighs> even, but you didn't get into the V position. To do this, pull back the mouse immediately after the well, start. Excuse me, but what is that if it's not a V, Attention, sir? we're off. V! You're being pushed to the left. Yes! Steer to the right. To be honest, I'm pushing myself to the left. You have to maintain balance. I'm trying. And to, 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 stop go. making me restart. Stop, stop, stop it. You're being oh. pushed. <laughs> You have to maintain. I'm doing go. it. Oh. Oh, that's something flying the over my head. Steer to the How am I supposed to do anything with stuff flying over my head? Is that me? Is that me in my plane? You have to maintain. That looks suspiciously like the gameplay steady. Jenny plane. I think somebody has nicked my plane while I'm trying to learn to ski jump. Now you have to land. I do. Push the mouse forward to finish the V position. Okay. Once the altitude meter at the bottom on the right turns green, you can land safely. No, I can't. Press the left mouse button. You will land automatically. What I am doing, sir, is putting my mouse... Let's go. Matt, back the other way. Ooh, you that looked painful. You need to landing a little earlier. To do this, press the left mouse button. That looked really painful. Ouch. Attention, we're off. But yeah, somebody's nicked my plane and... Uh... Excellent landing. The judges will be satisfied. Now you need to keep your balance right up to the fall line. Oh, God, really? If you get slightly off balance and go to one side, you have to steer against it with the mouse. I've kind of got the mouse thing now. I've kind and of on we go. Got the mouse thing. Thank you. Watch out. You're losing your balance. Steer with the mouse to the left. Otherwise, you might eventually fall. Right. Steer, steer to the left. Steer, steer to the... Oh! Unfortunately, you lost your balance before reaching the fall line. Try again. What's the point of a foil line not that you fall? Go. Watch Ooh, out. my goodness, this is sensitive. That is insanely sensitive. I'm not joking. I think I just moved my mouse like Ready, five steady, millimeters. Go. I'll do it slower. Slow, slow. Watch out. Slow. Whoa. Unfortunately, there's let's a reason go. why this is a game on its own. It's because it's insanely 
difficult. Right, you can I remember no all of that? Keeping your balance. Now, there's not much that can go wrong. Oh, I bet there is. But you also need to learn how to slow down. To do this, steer the skier to one of the two boards with the mouse. But does it matter if I slow down? Attention, we're off. Does it matter if I slow down? That's the thing. I don't think it does. I'm just going to do this. Mm. I could end up in the house, though. I always end up in the bits I shouldn't end up in on skiing games. Oof. Well, learning to be a ski jumper turns out to be a little bit more difficult than I thought it would do, but it's fine. I'm still going to be awesome at it. I mean, check that out. Or don't, because there's something in the way. That's a terrible camera angle. Anyway, he's happy, so I'm happy. Are we happy, George? Every jump starts at the start bar. Right, can we stop this now? I, I know how to do this now. Let's do something else. Like, actually compete. Okay, I lied. I'm actually brilliant at ski jumping. All of this has just been a complete masquerade. I can actually do it, and I'm so good at it, that I'm going to have a career in it. But I need to create a skier of my own. Well, let's do that then. Skill levels should probably go for easy. I get loads of money. If I choose if I choose easy, I get loads of money. Why wouldn't everybody choose easy? I get 5,000 thingies for that. Right, we're well, definitely doing that then. So, um, let's go through the... Wow. The, uh, the mass murderers of the ski jumping world. It's got to be him, hasn't it? Are they all blokes as well? Oh, well, I'll go with old googly eyes here. And then uh, I want to be Great Britain. No team jumping. Well, I'm not joining Italy then. They've got no team jumping. Neither of any of these. And neither of we, in fact. Oh, dear. Oh, well, that's a shame. I'll just have to have no team jumping then. What the hell is team jumping? Jumping in a team? What, do you all go down at once? Yeah. Yeah, let's continue. Let's continue. Right, then I've got to put points in things. Well, if you think I weigh that much, excuse me, I do not. It won't let me adjust it either. I'm certainly not that, that tall. In fact, I'm, I'm not even that tall. Do I need to be? Ah, oh, there we go. Right, now I can take my weight down to roughly... <clears throat> okay, there is actually a minimum weight, but surely it's all got to go in jumping strength, hasn't it? Why, why have I got no... Why have I got no points left? Ah, so the taller I am... Hang on a minute, what? The more I weigh, the more I get points for the... Fit. Right, well, that's a bit discriminatory, isn't it? The more I weigh, the more strength I have in the jump right. There, there we go. Right, just put it all into jumping strength. Excellent. I'm going to own everybody. Right, what we got now? Approach technique, flight technique, not fight technique, flight technique, landing technique. Yeah, okay, we'll have those even. I don't know which is more important. Right, so what is my first name? My first name is Jenny. Oh, no, it's Jens, actually. It's just come out as Jet. Right, fine. That sounds a little bit more ski jumpery. It's Jens Ski Mat. If you don't know the origin of that, you can go back and watch a separate Winter Olympic video, which is in the top right hand corner. Definitely finished. <sighs> we all know that. Right, I'm going to go for my single player then in the juniors with the 12 year olds. Here we go. I'm quite excited. Hey, up. Elk Death Liqueur. The elk death liqueur is a speciality in your home country. You had wanted to do honorary advertising for them, but how can you say no to 170 euros? What, are they paying me 170 euros not to do advertising for them? I'll take it. I'll take money for not doing things, that's fine. I don't know what that meant, but I'm quite excited about the fact this is going to be one of those crazy German games where little story things happen to you. Just like in On The Ball World Cup Edition, which I'm going to be able to play later this year because it's World Cup. Yay! Anyway, right. Um, yeah. So there is Jenny Ski Mat in a German helmet. That's no good. If I go to the shop, can I buy a new helmet? Yeah, I don't like that. It's got Germany on it. Oh, no. Need to be... Oh, need to be better. Fine. Can I buy anything at all? Can I have a new suit? I don't want a blimmin' suit from 1997. That's disgusting. I bet loads of people have used it. Oh, there, uh, there is one I can have, though. There is one I can have. It's very expensive. But look at the balance. Balance 90. Yeah. Why not? I've got the money. Let's spend it. What else can I have? New skis? No, I can't have new skis. 
How about a new... No, 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 hang on a minute. No, I've already got that. How about new goggles? No new goggles for Jenny. New gloves? I don't know what difference gloves would make. Oh, gameplay Jenny gloves. Oh, I've got to have some gameplay Jenny gloves, definitely. How much better are they than I have? Aerodynamics 20, balance 100. Aerodynamics 40, balance 90. I should be fine. I should be fine. Let's have those. Yeah. That's better. That's a bit more me. Right, shoes. Can I have Jenny's shoes as well? No. Bindings? New bindings? No, no new bindings. And masks. New mask? Oh. Well, I'd look even more like a serial killer. If I took... Oh, that's distressing in the extreme, isn't it? Let's have that. Right, I'm now really, really aerodynamic. Brilliant! Get out of the shop. Get out of the shop. Right, wax. According to the snow data, the two simplest kinds of wax are used here in the winter. Good! If you play in the amateur or professional league, this is not sufficient to secure a top place. But in the junior league, is it amazing? Wax manually. Wax master. You can take on a master waxer who will do your wax mixture for you. Right. I'll do my own. In fact, I'll just, there we go. Let's just do it automatically because I don't know what that means. Right, some training. Should we do some training? Trainer market. Oh, we've got uh, Carl Gustav Stockbroker. He's clearly not a trainer of any sort. Oh, we've got the head of Nintendo and we've got the head of Nintendo America. He actually is the head of Nintendo America. That's incredible. We've got Henrik Larsson, who I'm pretty certain is a footballer. We've got Martin Hamilton, who looks like he works for a bank. We've got a Slovenian dude who looks like he should be a ham radio operator. We've got a wrestler from France. Or we've got this incredibly mysterious person. Oh wait, we've got no, no, oh god. Crumbs. I feel like we should do him. He's very motivational, but equally. Should we have the British bloke? about the Japanese dude, who is utterly unknown in the world of ski jumping, and rightly so. Skills. Increasing my weight. What's he going to do? Stuff me with sushi? I like him already. Let's do it. <sighs> Excellent. Right. So, successful extra training will get me an additional 40 points. Do some extra training, then. Let's go to Norway. I think I want to live in Norway. I did a what Scandinavian country should you live in test the other day, as you do, and it came out with Norway. But I thought it would come out with Iceland, so that was, that was a bit strange. Anyway, there's nobody here to experience this embarrassment. Thank God. We couldn't even get a lift. I've got to walk all the way to the top. Yep, just not the helmet to make sure that it works. Goodness me. Serial killer on skis. Here we go, then. I'm officially terrified. <laughs> Not sure I'm going to be even to be able to do this. Right, press the left mouse button. I remember that bit. There doesn't seem to be much wind. That's good. So, line. Jump. Pull back. That's a V. That's a V. That's a V. That's a V. That, that's a... There! Ooh, ooh, ooh. I sat down. I sat down. But I'm not dead. Are you crying? N no, you're just sort of appealing to the gods of ski jumping there. Well, personally, I thought that was okay. This little invisible wall. Bit of miming there. Very nice. Very nice. I didn't think that was too bad. Distance, 93. Is that not some sort of British record? Oh, oh. It wasn't a total bail. I don't know whether that was good or bad or not. Well, obviously it was bad because I sat down, but... Uh, oh, this time you didn't manage the assignment because of a fall. Was that a waste of 300 euros then? <laughs> should get a better trainer, shouldn't I? Oh, I have got a bit better at something. Just very fractionally. <clears throat> okay. There was no sushi for Jenny, though. Let's continue. We're going to the Trondheim Junior Euro Cup with the 12-year-olds. Hello from Trondheim, Norway. In the district of... Please excuse my pronunciation, which might be a bit odd. You're excused. Sor Trundelag. You're not excused. I'm sure that not only fans of the British team will be happy to hear that my co-commentator today is Colin Phillips. I've literally never Next heard of him. Be competing again, that's for sure. We all hope that, and we keep our fingers crossed for you. 
Today is the first competition in the Junior League's European Cup, so let's have a look at the youngsters. There's one. The others are all queued up behind going, go, Jenny. Go, Ski Mac. Go, go, go. Oh, goodness, right. Yikes. Must not fall. Must not fall. There's no win, though. That's good. I don't need to worry about that. I must not fall. Right there. There. Oh, I went too early. Until oh, no. He really oh, no. Oh, oh, my head. Oh, my poor out. head. I, I think I've killed him. I'm so sorry. That was terrible. Thanks to technology, we can look at the replay and be clear about things. What, that I fell on my head? I can promise you without any technology that I definitely fell on my head. Oh dear, oh, oh. Oh. Has anybody called an ambulance? I don't need to see that again. Right. If the ski jumps were really roofed over, as certain experts are proposing, competitions would no longer be cancelled because of bad weather conditions. Yeah, but on the other hand, it would be an enormous investment for the operators. Have I got to watch all of these? The atmosphere. Like when I approach running a tunnel, no thank you. That, that was lovely, but I, I, I can't. There's no kicking through. He has a look at the video of this flight tonight. I've got to watch yeah, everybody go down the hill. The judges. This will give you an extra motivation for the next competitions. Right, so now I'm second, but soon I will be third, and then fourth, and then fifth, and then off your screen somewhere. That's no good, is it? Fortunately, oh, the ski jumps are not. Oh! Oh! I see! What's plus, 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 plus then? That's all of them! Oh, in that case, I don't need to go through the pain. So, this is the result of the qualification round. Ouch. Let's see who's among the top 50 so we can tell who will start again today. Not me, I'm not in the top 50. So, I just need to calculate the rest of it then. To discover. But, Ladies uh, and gentlemen, here I'm dead last are the final results for your information. I'd be glad to have you with us again next time. And many thanks to my co-commentator, Colin Phillips. Oh, thanks to you too, Mark. Thanks for having me. Thank you, everyone. See you next time. See you next time. You're welcome, but... OK. So it's actual full competitions. And if you fail miserably, you've got to watch everybody's... Oh, my goodness. Well, there's no prize money, strangely enough. And now my coach has gone AWOL. Excellent. Well, that's great. I'm going to get a better coach, I think. I don't like you, Mr. Nintendo. I'm going back to the trainer market to take on um, your American co-conspirator. There, let's have him. There we go. Right, I'm going to do my extra training with him. I'm sure he'll be fine. Let's go to Sweden. I have not waxed my skis. Oh, maybe I need to get a waxer in as well. Maybe that's where it's all going wrong. A wax master. Well, he's... Happy. I think he might be laughing at my ski jumping, actually. He looks like somebody who just wheeled his caravan in. He's a uh, Polish stand-up comic. Austrian bloke looks like he's done something he really wants you to know about. Um, he's never South Korean in a million years. Austrian dude. Oh, a woman. Oh, we've got to have her. She's a solid and very sympathetic waxer who unfortunately does not always choose the right wax mixture. Maybe because she does not understand a word that is not in her mother tongue. Well, that's okay, I can speak French. Allo. Madame Le Waxing. Wax Le Skis, s'il vous plaît. Excellent. Yeah. That's good, I'm sure that's fine. Okay, let's see if that makes any difference at all. I will do my extra training. In Le Suede. You need to come to Le Suede and Le Wax Le Skis. Pour Le Not Crash. Yeah. There we go then. If I could just land one jump, that would be amazing. Here we go. Oh no, it's windy, it's windy, it's windy. Right, so you gotta hold it down, hold it up, pull it back, do that. Oh, that was, that was face first this time, wasn't it? Oh my goodness, I'm so sorry. I know, I've, you've probably got several concussions by now. This is really difficult. Oh, you're going to give me some points anyway. Mr. Parnage, who looks suspiciously like he might be from like Tonga or something. I don't know. There we go. Well, I've improved a little bit again. This is really bad. 
I don't fully understand what I'm doing wrong, but obviously I'm getting something very, very wrong. So it's time to go to the Nordic Juniors tournament with Sweden. the this town of 55,000 inhabitants is host to today's ski jumping event. Now, right, let's just go through all the people who can do it and then we'll get to me. British ski jumping, if I may say so. Well, let's not exaggerate. And credit where credit is due, sir. I've never even heard of him. Anyway, like right, there's a bit of wind. There's a bit of wind. The there. There. Pull back. There. Oh, oh, oh. God, he got away oh well. Any serious injuries after this fall, we'll have to thank his lucky stars. Did you see how the disaster happened? Oh, it yes. looked as if the skis edged yes, over did. during the landing, and then this horrible somersault. Oh, let's keep our fingers crossed for him, Mark, that he's not too badly hurt. Yeah. You see, in the summer games, that probably would have won me something. But that was... wow. Good lord. Okay, well, once again, I won't be going through to the top 50. Or indeed getting up again at all, because I'm now in hospital. I hope Swedish hospitals are nice. Oddly enough, I uh, I didn't win anything, and uh, apparently I went out on the apres ski afterwards. That's uh, that's good. Oh, and I can't afford the French woman now, either. Great. Okay, well, it's fine. I'm sure I can automatically wax everything. Right, come on, Mister, Mister. Oh, I can't, oh, I can't even afford him anymore. Can I? Oh, good lord. I have to have the German dude then, aren't I? Right, come on, German dude. I'm sure. I'm sure I can land one of these. Just give me some instructions. At least I'm getting a tour around the world. We're going to the Czech Republic now. Peter Peterson is the record holder. Not the original names record, though. And that's a slightly smaller hill, so I'm sure I'll be fine. Okay, here we go. Right, just gotta land. I've just gotta land. That's all I've gotta do is, is land. Okay, so my skis look... Ooh, no, they don't. I was going to say my skis look good, but they don't look good at all. Hold it down, bring it up, bring it back. Ooh, no! <gasps> oh, well, I landed. I landed. I landed. I just went about two feet. And I'm crying. But look at my style marks, 15s. That, that's okay, isn't it? And that's the police coming to arrest me for bad ski jumping. I don't want to see it again. I completed my training, though. Do I get some points for that? Yes! Excellent. Right, I just don't seem to be able to take off. What if I put some more stuff into power? And a bit of fitness. Maybe I don't have the motivation to jump off the hill. That's entirely possible. I'll make myself weigh a little bit more as much as I don't want to. There we go. There we go. Well, that was better. Maybe I'll land one in the Junior Euro Cup this time. Maybe I'll land on the 12 year olds. Kill all 12 year olds, win the competition. We're on the northern faith of Mount Antola Hora, where no fewer than five ski jumps make our skiing heart race. Today I have Colin Phillips at my side who will give us first hand information about ski jumping. Hi there, Colin. Hello, Mark. I don't like these conditions. I'm happy to be here too. Hello, I'm not. And gentlemen. Then well, for the top skiers, qualification is just a sort of practice, as 50 out of 72 skiers qualify for the next round. But the weaker athletes have to make an effort if they don't want to be weeded out. You see, for me, it's not so much, uh, uh, you know, just a bit of practice, it's more whether I can stay alive. But I don't like this weather, and it's a bit windy. Right, okay, here we go then. There. There. That's Pull them back. There. No. No. On the plus side, I do seem to have got a better helmet, and I don't know how I managed that. Uh, right, let's have a so look then. Where am the first I? On the way to victory, that was they gave me 25 points just for turning up. That's good of them. <sighs> right, I'm getting really mad now. This is way more difficult than I thought it would be. And it would be so nice to just, um, to just jump. So I've got 4,000 euros for doing literally nothing. Well, I can afford a waxer again, can't I? Maybe I need a wax master, master, master. Who's the best waxer of all? It's Nikolai Oblomov of Russia. And he's gonna cost me a lot but I think that would be good. Yeah. 
Let's hope that waxing is the problem. Chris Black bets me 900 euros that he will outdistance you at least one round. Yeah, whatever, sir. Whatever. Right, can I afford training now, still? I think I can. Right, let's go to Garmisch in Germany. Let's land one blinking jump. I should say one more. Because I have managed one, just the one. Right, I can do this. I can do this because my waxing's at 100% now. Here we go. Right, it's going to be fine. It's going to be fine. Okay, so... Get it in the centre. Go from there and there and pull it back. And then... There. Oh, I sat down again. Right, this is doing my head in now. And my bum. And everything. Oh. This is so frustrating. I genuinely do not know what to do. Right. Time to embarrass myself again, then. I just need to land Let's one enjoy flipping the view for a moment. jump. Today we are in Garmisch. Just As one, just one flipping jump. Today I've spent a fortune on waxing. The famous ski jumper Colin Phillips from England. He's not famous. I've never heard of him. The right himself. there, there. Pull it back. Pull it down, teams. down. Maybe I'll take over your job soon, yes. <laughs> yes. Actually landed something. Junior League's European Cup. Get in. Yeah! Crowd's cheering. Crowd's cheering. Let's have a look at the replay. Yeah, let's do, because nobody can believe that I actually landed anything at all. What I don't understand about doing a whole competition is how on earth are you supposed to be good enough? I suppose technically you're supposed to practice, aren't you? Because practice makes perfect. 40! Despite several renovations, this key... 40? Is that all I got? After that Many amazing jump? That <gasps> is sometimes harder to get so to nearly not last then. Than... So nearly not last. Am I going to get money for that, do you think? Give me 4,000 more euros and I will come not last. Oh. This coach has gone AWOL. AWOL? AWOL as well. Just can't afford anything. I can't afford anything. I don't think I can afford any training either. Well, this is genuinely awful. I'm not betting anything with anybody, I'm afraid. I'm going to have to go for automatic waxing. Can I train? Can I train? Can I afford you? I can. We're off to Oslo, where the record holder is Benjamin Lager. That's what I need. More beer. See, my waxing now is 72.2. That's not good at all. Right. Come on, Johnny. Come on, you can do this. There. There. Pull back, pull back, pull back, pull back. Then go forward. Oh, I've sat down again. This is just horrific in the extreme. I just want to cry. I can't ski jump. And I thought I was amazing at it. And I'm not. Because this is really difficult. I don't want them to look again at me sitting down. I don't want to ever look at a ski jumping thing ever again. This is rubbish. Even sponsored by beer, I can't be any good at ski jumping. Right, fine. We'll go to Oslo. We'll see if I can land something. And if I can't, I'm retiring. I'm handing in my skis and my wax and the possibly my brains when I fall. It. I have a special guest today. Colin Phillips, would you mind me saying that it's a stroke of luck in a certain way? That you're not participating in the competition today. Mm, no, no, I'll right. take it as a compliment. Ooh, ooh, don't go over there, don't go over there, don't go over there. No, 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 don't do that. There, now. A further day of competition. Now, the down. Yes. The young oh my god, I've landed one. I've landed one. I've only blinking gone and landed something. Career. I got 15 style points on that. There's a hot oil balloon over there. I'm getting up and flying off in that. If this doesn't make me come anything other than last. Let's take the time to. Where am I? Where am I? I think I did a thing. Let's see which 50 skiers have qualified for the next round. I well, didn't you can see some faces. 
Ski jumping is my thing after all. Sort of. Well, it's more than these people. It's more than so these people from Austria. It's been an exciting competition. I can't believe it. I didn't come last. Well, there might not be any prize money, but I came 65th instead of 72nd. But I've been invited to a quiz show where I can win lots of money. Well, I'm better at quizzes than I am at ski jumping, for sure. <laughs> this is bizarre, what the hell? Okay. Start the quiz. Which German ski ace? What's his nickname? I've got a bloody idea. Gasmeyer. No. No, okay. So I can't even do quizzes either. I officially retire. That was genuinely horrific. And you know what? I'm really sorry because I thought I'd be doing amazing jumps and being fantastic. And I'm not at all. I'm going to have to go off and actually practice this. And then you'll come back and I'll be amazing. But for the time being, I'm horrific. And I need to know things about ski jumping. Is that because... Don't scratch... Right, that's it. I quit. Gameplay Jenny.